Oh my gosh, I am so excited to do this training. So I'm gonna be comparing chili to business. I know, I know, I don't cook, I don't even grocery shop, but chili is one thing that I do know how to make. I don't even actually know if you could ever make it wrong. Um, but I have something amazing for you at the end of this. So you've gotta make sure that you stay till the end because I have a gift for you and it's something that I think will be very, very beneficial. Not just to you, but to your teammates as well if you're a network marketer. Um, because we're all on this journey to where we wanna go, um, but sometimes we need help identifying where we're at exactly and what else we need to help us get to the end result. So, I was going to do this training and compare it to a marathon, but I thought, well, that's really crazy because I don't run and I've never ran a marathon. I don't cook, but I have cooked chili, so it's. I thought it'd be a little bit more authentic to who I was. So, um, when you are in business for yourself, I want you to know that there's are there are highs and there are lows. There are ups and there are downs, and it's to be expected. And during that, those down times and the low times where you're like, I just want to quit, and this is stupid, and I hate it. I want you, I want you to stop. Um, so this training is on mindset. I want you to, I want you to stop and I want you to say, okay, what can I learn from this? Like this sucks. It's shitty. I don't like being here, but what can I learn? So the next time I start feeling this downward turn, which is you will have, what can I do to cushion it? So a lot of it's mindset and expecting the highs and the lows. Um, but also, um, it's a huge opportunity for growth, huge opportunity for for growth. So I am going to, yes, compare a successful business and how to have a successful business to making a pot of chili. Make sure you stay till the end, you guys, because I have something that you do not want to miss out on. You're going to want to share it. It's going to give you so much clarity on where you need to be working and growing. It's the bomb. I'm just saying it's the bomb. It's going to blow your mind. So, um, so many people in business focus on the end result. And my daughter does this too. She wants to read so dang bad, but she won't do her phonics. She won't practice sounding out her words, but she wants to read so damn bad, but she's not doing the things to get her there. And I see it all the time. People want to hit this rank. I want to hit this rank. I want to hit this rank. rank. And then they don't hit it and they get frustrated. They get down. A lot of people quit in network marketing. Let's be real. A lot of, most people don't make it past 90 days. They don't make it past three month mark because they didn't invest a lot to start the business. And so they just quit and it blows my mind. But I see it all the time. Um, so frustration comes in, people shut down, people quit when they don't hit that end result that they want. But what's happening is they're not doing the things to get them there. And so this is where the chili comes in. I want you to think of, I want, I, for tonight for dinner, I want chili. That's the end result. Same thing as, I want chili for dinner tonight is the same thing as ranking up in your business, okay? These are the end results. Eating chili, ranking up, okay? And so before I go to make chili, I wanna say, okay, I wanna do it tonight and I need a recipe. So I start doing research online. Like I get on there, I'm like, ooh, this recipe looks good. This sounds good. This is quick, easy, perfect. So I print the recipe off. Now I gotta admit a, a list of ingredients that I need to get, get. So the next thing I do is I go to my cabinets. What's up, Courtney Barlow? Thanks for hopping on, girl. Oh my gosh, you guys. Make sure you say hi. If you're watching this as a replay, also let me know that you stopped in to say what's up. So I know that you were here and I'm super excited. If you're just hopping on, make sure you stay till the end because I have something so awesome for you. I'm jacked up to share it with you. Okay, so I have my recipe for my chili and I go to my cupboard, I go to my cabinets. I'm like, okay, I have black beans. Okay, I have onion powder. I don't even know what goes in chili. So I'm like, okay, I have these things, but now I gotta go to the grocery store and get the rest of these ingredients. So you make, you schedule time. 
to get in your car, to go to the grocery store, or you schedule time to get on your phone and go to Instacart and or click list and have the grocery get all these things but you schedule the time to do it so now now we're at the grocery store and I'm walking through the aisles and I'm getting the things to add to my chili some ground beef some tomato stuff some peppers because I like mine spicy um, some more beans because I love me some beans and so we're doing we're doing all these things okay and so now it's like I got all the ingredients and I need to check out now I need to go back home and am I going to make it after work? Am I going to make it now? And so it's like, okay, I need to cook the ground beef. I need to chop the onions. I need to do all these things for my chili. So I can eat chili tonight because chili is the end result. Chili is like ranking up in your business. Okay. And so it's like, okay, I make time to prep everything. Now I'm putting all the ingredients together and now I'm cooking it and simmering it. And after you do all these things, guess what happens? You get to eat chili tonight for dinner because that's what you wanted. But it started with doing research on the computer to find a recipe. The same thing happens when you wanna rank up in your business or you wanna accomplish something. You gotta do the groundwork, you got to do the things. And it's all those little things that we did to make a pot of chili. It's the same thing in network marketing. It's all these little things that are gonna make a huge difference. If you're picking up what I'm throwing down, give me some love. Give me some hearts across that screen. If this is making sense, you guys. So, let me ask you. Gonna ask you. Are you doing the things? Are you doing the things? Are you finding the people to talk to? Are you making the sales? Are you wearing or using the service or product? Are you studying closing? Do you even know where you're at to be able to get to where you want to go? Do you know what's missing? Do you even know what the things are that you need to do? And I can honestly say, most people don't even know what the things are. Your upline can put out training all day long, but most people still don't know what the things are. So this tool that I created is going to help you identify where you're at now. And what needs to change? Where do you need to focus a little bit more energy, a little bit more time? Um, if you comment below with the word, <laughs> hold on, I can't remember what the word is, with the word skills, comment below with the word skills and Lulubot will send you over some information and you can get this tool that I created to help you clearly identify where you're at now what does it look like? What does it feel like? Uh, what are some areas that you can focus on now? If you focus on improving those areas, what's going to happen next? What's going to show up? And I promise you, I want you to do this tool today. I want you to do skills, drop skills below. And I want you to do this balance wheel today. And then I want you to set an alarm in your phone to do it again in, in 90 days. Do it again in three months. Okay? three months, I want you to do it again. And I want you to look comparison to where you're at now and where you're heading. And I want you to share your results with me. And I want to celebrate wins with you. I want to help guide you. But first thing we need to do is find out where you're at and kind of assess your business. This is a, it's an assessment. Where are you at? What's it look like? Okay. And if this is where you're going, what areas need improvement? And this is going to help you find the things that you need to do and that you need to work on. It's gonna help you find the recipe. It's gonna help you look in your cupboard and see what you have versus what you need to go to the grocery store and buy. It's gonna help you prep the, prep the food. Um, and it's doing the things that are gonna get you to the end result. So um, do you have a recipe? Do you know what skills that you don't even know that you don't even know that you don't even have? You, this tool is gonna to blow your mind because it's going to Pull the blindfold off and you're going to realize that I didn't even know that I didn't even know that. So drop skills below. If you have any questions, make sure you comment. Uh, let me know what, um, what you find out. What taking this blindfold off reveals to you. And make sure that you share this video with your teammates. Um, you can share it with them now. Or you can share it with them after you do the... Um, business assessment and 
I'm just really, I'm really excited for you to see what happens and what comes up and what shows up in some aha moments. So I love you guys. I will talk to you soon. And I hope you have a super duper amazing day. Bye now.